But before we go further, let's dispense with a term first. Sometimes our teachers use the term Pareto efficiency. Now, this is a term that usually results in the same outcome as the allocative efficiency. Why? Because Pareto efficiency simply refers to a situation where no improvement to welfare can be made without making someone else worse off. So it is the optimum position, and that usually happens to be the position of allocative efficiency. But it does not simply mean the same thing. Let's bring up the PPC again. Now let's say you are producing at this point in the middle right now. So what is Pareto efficient? It is anything within this quadrant so that you do not make anyone else worse off. And um, it is good if the allocatively efficient point is within uh, this quadrant, but what if it isn't? What is somewhere around here? And then it won't be Pareto efficient, but it is allocatively efficient. So this might be an oversimplified uh, illustration, but it does point out one of the maybe limitations of Pareto efficiency.